I'm the only girl in this class, so it's really nice just proving that we can do it too. 17-year-old Julia Tremblay is a whiz at welding. Each of these flowers is put together in layers that I cut out on the plasma cam. It took me about a month and a half. Tremblay is a champion welder. Two years in a row, she took home the gold at a statewide competition. This year's winning work, a bouquet for mom. I used to pick wildflower bouquets in our yard for my mom, and I was probably six or seven. So I was like, well, I'll make another one, but these flowers are never going to die, you know? Previously, she won gold for this logging truck, which honors her grandfather and father. My parents were so proud of me. They just loved that he do it. Tremblay is a senior at Kingswood Regional High School in Wolfboro. She also takes classes at the Lakes Region Technology Center. Students here learn everything from precision manufacturing to theater stagecraft and health science, says the center's principal, Kathy Tatro. The Lakes Region Technology Center is a two-year program it's with work-based learning. We have students here that come from four different schools. We have about 85% of our students who are um, going right into industry or on to post-secondary education. I really want to go into a job and do like fabrication as a job and be building stuff and working on stuff, but I also don't want to lose my creative side. I still want to be able to do sculpture as a hobby on the side. Initially, Tremblay's brothers sparked her interest in welding. My brothers, they took the same course that I'm taking. My brother George is a welder. I took this class wanting to go into cosmetology and be an esthetician, you know? And then as soon as I started welding, I was like, wow, I really enjoy this. And I just kept practicing. The feeling of just knowing you're getting better, it's just such a good feeling. I wish girls wouldn't cut themselves short because we can do it. We're good at it. Just got to give yourself that opportunity. An opportunity that Tremblay treasures here in the hills of New Hampshire's Cotton Valley. And Julia heads to Atlanta in Ooh. June to compete in a national welding competition for Skills USA. That's awesome. And we should also <laughs> add that the Technology Program Center also has a very successful welding program. They've had for quite a few wins under their belt as well. Mm -hmm. And that is Chronicle for tonight. Thank you so much for joining us. I'm Shana Seymour. And I'm Anthony Everett. Have a great evening. Look forward to seeing you back here again tomorrow night. Good night, everybody. <laughs>